hey guys and welcome back to another video so yeah it's uh, been a while i think for vanguard so uh it's a little busy so uh some videos that i'm working on like my duelings one and the one uh that i'm working on for zero as well is probably gonna take a while but uh yeah hopefully i get them out soon but today uh finally it's the first of april and the new set has come out in zero infinite rebirth and i'm very excited for a certain unit if you've been following me you can probably guess um based on the clan i've been playing haha <laughs> but anyways uh let's go ahead to the gacha and just open some uh before we do though three two one uh ride the vanguard almost messed up there but uh almost anyways let's head over to the gacha yeah loading screens are uh, a little, little long okay finally here we are so this is deck build volume 4 but this is not the gacha that i'm gonna open the overdress gacha is here as well so in case you're wondering what that is you can get overdress characters by spending uh, 1000 gems to open the to open the pack to sorry to open the set 10 times and you can get one overdress medal for every 10 times you open it's kind of crazy because in order to get one uh, character you need 10 of these overdress medals uh, sorry not 10 100 i believe so they are going to you're going to have to open a lot of packs and spend a lot of gems if you have money then go for it i guess so i also have a triple rare gacha ticket here and as you can see for the regular gacha uh, gacha tickets i have 99 so it's still uh, quite exciting we can open a lot almost a hundred so the reason why i just didn't get a hundred packs yet even though i'm so close is well i want to get the video out as soon as possible and also because we have the triple rare gacha ticket here which i kind of want to open last so that'll be our 100 pack but to be honest i'm not sure if we're gonna open a hundred actually i'll see what i get and then when i'm satisfied i'll just end it there uh <laughs> end the video there i suppose so let's open uh, nine packs for now and i really wanted to show the units off but uh, they're not appearing yet so yeah i've saved uh, i've saved up some gachas and finally um the last the last arc of link choker has arrived oh uh, no triple rare oh wow what do we do? oh sneaky triple rare okay i would appreciate a certain triple rare i am aiming to get a certain card and i hope that i oh sp double rare okay that's nice i do hope i i do hope i get a uh, play set of the units that i want so i don't really have to craft them but i did save crafting material so oh sorry about that okay Especially so that uh, I don't have to throw all of my packs either on this set. Legion is coming, so I want to save some up for Legion as well. I'm free to pl I'm free to I'm a free to play player, so yeah. Bear with me if I don't use up all of my hundred gacha tickets. But let's see here. The triple rare we got is Dragonic um, Panout, Parnout. I think Panout. I think um when place counter blast one and grab an overlord from your oh no 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 wait sorry a counter blast one and remove from play an overlord from your drop zone uh to retire one of your opponent's rear guards uh is that is that good i'm not sure if that's good you are like 
removing from play and revenge i mean uh overlord here we have another double rare limit break four when attacking the vanguard counter blast one and uh retire two revengers and for that battle get plus 10k in a crit okay not not that bad i guess counter blast oh when please counter blast one from your deck call a grade one or lower unit to the same um column as this unit yeah yeah i think so yeah yeah that's its ability okay not bad then we have some others here uh this one's pretty uh good i think when plays from deck put this unit into your soul and then look at the top three cards and call a liberator so yeah uh, i really i like that card so i'm glad i got him let's see if i can use him today oh finally okay the unit showed up so that's overlord the rebirth i don't really plan to play the rebirth honestly but hmm all right let's get going come on i uh, no no triple rare confirmation that makes me really worried come on uh nope nothing yet nothing interesting yet oh okay uh no triple rare for real come on the things wasn't this sp oh this is the sp version sorry let's see blood master when placed um when placed if you have four or less damage counter blast one and from the top of your deck place but i'll place a card as face down place a card face down in your damage zone uh place a, uh, sorry place a card from the top of your deck in your damage zone face down and draw two cards okay so you take a damage to draw two cards uh, okay i mean i guess drawing two is nice and you do have to have four or less so you'll only be at five and there you go that's the guy i'm looking for let's hope i get lucky here and go triple rare triple rare triple rare come on what 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 maybe if i don't say anything then i'll get good luck seems like every time i hope for something good this happens uh, i see we're getting double rares here but i'm really looking for those important triple rares it's much easier to craft double rares uh, i guess nothing of note here for me anyway i wonder how to make these pack openings more exciting come on let's go let's go and oh oh come on yes okay there we go we got us we got a triple rare i'll open it last no oh it's again glendio so okay I, I don't i'm not a link joker main but okay i guess i can do something with that um okay star vader omega glendios okay we also got this um malgo let's see what does he do uh limit break four once per turn current blast two and e a um put a liberator uh, oh counter blast two once per turn for you can put a liberator to the bottom of your deck and then to activate the skill which is look at the top four cards of the deck call to and then for that turn they get five thousand power okay i guess that's budget not well maybe not budget i mean it's a double rare so of course it's easier than a triple rare so i suppose it's like an alternate to alfred but not really 
Yeah, I guess it's like a side deck that you can make. Might, might, who knows, might be decent in combination with other cards. Still no triple rare? Come on, game. I saved over a hundred packs for you. Hmm, so I opened about 40 packs, 49 technically, so... Do I want to use up the rest of the 50? I can just craft the card I need, but... Yeah, why not? It's for the video anyway. Go! Finally! A triple rare! Oh yeah! Okay, that's good. <laughs> Great! I got my boy. I'm kind of sad that he didn't really get a buff when he came to zero. It's still... Monarch Sanctuary is still a little bit... Uh, no, well, not bad. I guess his cost is a little bit high. Especially with the Soul Blast too. But then I guess if you have a lot of your rear guard to lock anyway, then it's not really uh, uh, nothing else. Okay, come on. Oh, all right. Then I suppose um, I suppose locking also doesn't isn't. I mean, locking isn't free either. It takes up a lot resources anyway. So um, yeah, I suppose that. Um, if the game doesn't go on for long enough, then, you know, you'll probably be fine uh, with using Monarch skill. Maybe you'll use it once in a game. Who knows? I think that's the point. Because it's uh, kind of strong. Let's continue and see what... Oh, and doubles only. Oh, well. At least we did get this. Very nice looking SP. Kind of looks like good get to me. Alright, 30 more packs. Let's go. Yeah, screw it. I'm just gonna use up my 30 packs. Even though I think I've slightly lost hope. I have. I've lost hope already. No triple rare this time either. I'm just gonna like cut away to the interesting bits. Oh, sneaky triple rare. Okay, I'll take that. Great. Already two. Um, my wow, I got a lot of double rares for Link Joker. Maybe the game wants me to try out Link Joker for a change. Twenty more. Let's go. Come on, doubles only. I'm still not gonna skip through it, but you know, after opening so many packs, I haven't opened it in a while, so I guess I forgot the feeling. But gachas really suck. They really do. They're very exciting when you, you know, get what you want, you get all the rare stuff. But when you don't. Because most of the time you don't, and then it's just this. Oh! Well, uh. Okay. Three, two, go! Oh! Oh, what? oh no! I spoke too soon. It's that. It's the terrible alternative to Glendios. It sucks. I would not want that report. Uh, Oh, I reacted too late, but we got another one. I'll open this one last. Three, two, come on, something good. Yeah, Overlord. I don't, well, okay. I mean, it kind of sucks to get, like, one copy of a triple rare that you may or may not use. And then you have, like, it's like, if you want to get a triple rare... 
you want to at least get ones that uh, are consistent, right? So even if you're not playing that deck, at the very least, you want to get uh, more two or more copies of that card, right? So, like, this might be the only Dragonic Overlord from this set that I get. It's the Brick Ride, by the way. They turned Overlord into a Brick Ride. Alright, last 10 packs. Well, actually, 99 in total. There's still one more pack left. Just the triple rare gacha ticket that I guess I'll use. Oh! Finally, we're getting lucky here. Really? You're gonna make me wait for so long? Oh, there you go! Oh, nice! Um, Star Trumpeter. Oh, that's a... That is an important card as well. Actually, I can't believe I forgot about uh, this one. But yeah, for golds, you probably want to run uh, Star Rain Trumpeter. Uh, when placed from your drop zone or from your soul, uh, return a Blaster Blade Liberator to your deck. To look at the top card of your deck and call it to, a open rear, to an open rear guard circle. This skill, uh, the cost of this skill uh, prioritizes putting back to deck from drop zone. So if you have a blaster, wait for drop? Yeah, from the drop, okay. So if you have a blaster blade in your soul, you can put it back to your deck, for example. But you need soul for Alfred, right? So it kind of helps that it prioritizes from the drop zone. Because you can use Blaster Blade Liberator early and then put it back into deck from drop. I believe that's very different from what she does in the original TCG, but uh, I don't really remember. But anyways, let's go ahead and open our triple rare, triple rare pack for the last gacha. I really ended up using it all. Oh well. Of course, triple rare. I would be. I would have been very worried if it wasn't. But let's go. Oh, out of all the triple rares, it's the worst one. Oh, what is it? Star Vader Reverse Cradle, I believe it's the name, I think. Cradle, yeah, Cradle, I think. Ah, this guy sucks. And I wanted at least, if it if it had to be Link Joker, I would have wanted Glendios at least. This is not that interesting. Limit break 4 once per turn, um, when your reverse unit is placed on rear guard, uh, randomly lock one uh, of your opponent's rear guards prioritizing the back row, and for that turn this unit gets plus 5k. Once per turn, as well. It's You get to lock something, but it's kind of terrible. Sucks. Uh, and then there's also a rear guard skill, so I suppose, I suppose that's not bad. When placed, if your vanguard is Star Vader Omega Glendios, uh, discard uh, Star Vader Omega Glendios from your hand and take a reverse unit from your drop zone and add it to your hand. I suppose you can, there's, since there's no reason you need, if you're already on Glendios, you don't really need to rewrite him, right? So, you know, I suppose that helps. But him, I honestly, I don't think he should be a triple rare. Should be a double rare at best. I hope. Uh, the I hope it wasn't that boring of a video for you guys. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. Um, I was really ex I was really hoping for more triple rares because those are super important. For the decks that I want to build, but oh well. Anyways, I'm I'm well, I'm at least satisfied with what I got. Uh, I got two of Liberator Monarch that I wanted. Star Rain Trumpeters there also, uh, so that's good. We even got some nice surprises like Glendios and uh, Overlord. But yeah, anyways, thanks a lot for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Uh, before we end it though. I haven't, I swear I didn't forget. 3, 2, 1. Uh, right, the Vanguard. Ah, it just hit me. I made a mistake earlier.
I said stand up. I said ride the vanguard the beginning of the video, but supposed to say stand up vanguard. Uh, pretend I didn't make that mistake and thanks for watching.